Hey everyone, it's Jamie from Best Nerd Life. Yeah, this video is going to be pretty interesting. It's going to be all about me moving down south. As you can probably see by the background, all that stuff there, all that stuff around there. These are all my belongings that are stuffed in my living room. Yeah, it's really fantastic to collect like retro video games and stuff until you have to move it all. <laughs> but yeah, uh, this is the Saturday morning. I'm just waiting for my parents to come with a big van so we can throw it all in there and get moving. So yeah, stay tuned for, uh, I don't know, some footage of us packing the van, some footage of us going down the motorway, I don't know, stuff like that. Probably setting up the room as well, like my room down there, because we've got an office and a lot of this stuff is going to go in there. So yeah, let's get going. Quite literally. <laughs> All right, so I didn't actually get that much footage of us moving down there. By the time we'd lifted all the stuff up into the van and all that kind of stuff, we were just a little bit tired and I just kind of got um, lost in the kind of flow of things. So yeah, I just got a bit of footage of us going down the motorway. Yes, that is a Greg's sausage roll pack as well as one of my hats. Now on to my actual room and the tour around it. So first off, this is my brand new like editing area where I've got my TV, my computer, my uh, keyboard and mouse and chair and all that kind of stuff. I'm gonna add to it later on but this at the moment is my editing space. I might add some sound uh, like absorbing stuff on the walls. I don't know yet but it's a nice little space at the moment. And now let's get on to the actual space itself. So yeah this is kind of an overview shot of the entire thing. A lot of this stuff I've managed to put in. There is a few things in boxes stored away, but the majority of the things I wanted to put out on my shelves, I've managed to put out. There's also a lot of uh, stuff that my girlfriend has, like a lot of this uh, is hers. Uh, for example, the Wii U games, they're hers. Quite a few uh, GameCube games, all that kind of stuff. So it's a pretty decent space so far. Let's have a closer view. So on the left here we have my cube storage. I'm not really sure what to do with it, it's just kind of got odds and ends in there, laptop, my Xbox, Dreamcast, all that kind of stuff, some stationery, you know, things like that I don't really know what to do with. And down below that you can't really see, there are just storage units full of wires and all that random stuff that you need as a game tech YouTuber person that I'm slowly becoming <laughs> on top of the cube storage there's a whole bunch of stuff there's some cuddly toys there's my pit boy in its box there's uh, some box consoles all that kind of stuff just uh, trying to fit as much stuff in this space as i can because honestly i don't have all that much room but the room i do have i'm definitely going to utilize onto my amiibo shelf now with Basically on my Amiibos, um, I'm really happy with my collection. I'm always trying to add to it and just build it. Also my Game Boy, some collectible Xbox 360 games like Duke Nukem, Bottle of Steel Edition, Fallout New Vegas, all that kind of stuff. Just, yeah, it's a pretty decent little space for them. Another shelving section here with a whole random assortment of stuff. So. You know, some Sinclair Hazard X Spectrum stuff, uh, some floppy disks, a Nintendo 64 game, Mega Drive stuff, uh, SNES stuff, just a whole bunch of random things that don't really have a dedicated shelf that I'm just kind of shoved together basically. But yeah, it, it's a, a pretty decent collection of stuff on this shelf. I'm really happy with the range of stuff that I'm collecting. So here's a couple of shelves now, so as you can see, DS, 3DS, GameCube, Wii, Wii U, um, Xbox, Xbox 360, lots of random things, Game Boy, we've got some Donkey Konga Bongos there, uh, a uh, thing full of floppy disks on the bottom there, just lots of different things that I'm shoving together that I'm really, really happy to collect. It's a very eclectic collection and I continue to build on it every single day. 
onto a higher shelf now and as you can see PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2 games as well as my growing collection of Dreamcast games which I'm very very happy to be collecting. It's a system I've never really played before and I think it's a very underrated system. Of course you've got um, Crash Bandicoot and Spyro, you've got Yoshi in his little cart there as well as a little mini figure arcade thing. Yeah, pretty cool. Another section with PlayStation 2 and PlayStation 1 games in there. A nice collection coming along. You'll notice on the top right hand corner uh, there is uh, Resident Evil 3 um, Japanese edition, uh, Biohazard I think it's called. Yeah, that's my girlfriend. She absolutely adores the Resident Evil franchise, as well as a bunch of figures like All Might, Pusheen, and Bendy from Bendy and the Ink Machines franchise thing. Onto an even higher shelf now, and yeah, this is the PlayStation 4 and PSP section. Now, a lot of those PSP games, especially the uh, JRPG ones, are my girlfriend's because she is a big fan of PSP games. And yeah, Spyro, you've got my little light up board, best nerd life thing, as well as a cuddly toy from my childhood, which yes, I am keeping on my shelf because yeah, it's just a nice little memory of where I've come from. And the rest of my shelves are full of my big box games and applications. So anything from the film director, uh, Atari ST application to I know Tomb Raider, <laughs> Hit List compilations, Simant, Total Annihilation, all that kind of stuff. Really happy that I'm building my big box collection because they're again quite hard to collect for. And that is my studio office thing uh, tour over and done with. Yeah, it was a really interesting uh, experience moving down south. Didn't get all the footage that I really wanted, but you know what? I was kind of busy doing other stuff. But in any case, if you enjoyed this video and want to see more, then by all means, like, comment, subscribe, do all that social media goodness, and as always, keep living that best nerd life.